Hi Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Let's see what your spirit guides want you to know at this moment. We have communication is key and your dreams need a practical plan, Capricorns. The answers that you need are coming. I have strong Gemini energy and Taurus energy that is wanting to come out here, Capricorns. All right, so there are some things that you want to manifest in regards to your goals here. Um, spirit is saying to keep going. Don't be so hard on yourself or overthink things because it's going to be um, causing a feeling of being overwhelmed here. So just take it easy. Be patient with yourself with the strength card and, you know, you will get to this obstacle. For others of you here, I have Leo energy and Capricorn energy. You are showing up right on the board as the overall energy here. So this is when someone is thinking about you at this very moment as we're going through this reading here. With the Five of Cups energy and rebirth and judgment, there's a lot of regret and sorrow over making a wrong decision. Now, this doesn't have to be them. This could be you, Capricorns. Again, overthinking a decision that you could have made here that led to heartbreak. This could be you confronting someone, you know, about like um, how they've been acting towards you and they backfired. They kind of like put it back on you type energy here. It doesn't have to be, but... There's a situation with the Virgo here that just simply just couldn't work out. I have Aries energy with the Emperor in reverse here. Full Moon Aries energy is all about taking action towards our goals here, you know, being really aggressive in that energy, okay? So with the, your King of Pentacles energy showing up with the Princess of Cups and the Ace of Swords, you kind of have to balance the stability, be grounded in your life as well as your emotions right now. Again, clarity, clear communication is coming in with the answers you need are coming with a new start is coming as well. So it's coming. <laughs> You're right. The answer that you need will um, happen within the next week or so. It could be two to three weeks here. But we have the Three of Cups energy. Go out. Have fun, Capricorns. I feel like you've been in your head, for some of you, on planning, 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 planning out your life. And when things don't go the way it you wanted to, it kind of um, feels destructive with the death card, okay? There's a Scorpio energy that is thinking about you, very attractive here. This could be like a recent connection. They're falling in love with you. And you could probably, for some of you Capricorns, you have caught feelings for someone and it's like, man, I'm scared to love again because of this past hurt. Like, I don't want to be a fool in the literal sense with the fool here. And I don't want to, you know... Um, cause pain to myself again by making a wrong choice, you know. So be gentle with yourself. Um I'm hearing from someone that you didn't deserve that. Like I didn't mean to hurt you. What the I don't know if this card was in reverse. I cannot remember. But <laughs> we have the seven of swords, the page of pentacles here. When I just read I get in the zone. Yeah, I'm getting from this person, like, I lost myself. I lost a sense of freedom. Like, I thought if I were to get in a relationship or things would get deeper, I would feel like a fool. I'm not happy with the way things ended. I look at your social media. Yeah, I'm going to call you. You have a hold on my heart, and I'm wondering who has your attention right now. Mm -hmm. You're on bother, Capricorns, you know. You're focusing on yourself for some of you, which is, which is good. You're working on your craft here if you, you know. In order to get stable, you have to work on your craft here and fill your cup up with your Empress energy. Remember that you are the Divine Feminine here. Is there any advice that Capricorn need at the moment? What does Capricorn need to know? To surrender. At times, we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives. Let it go and it will all work out. Okay, Capricorns? So be a little selfish with your time right now in these next two weeks here. Release what's no longer serving you in regards to your thought process here. You know, someone regrets not taking action towards you. They could see you out with someone else or posting you out. Your, you know, suitors are attracted to you. They could be hearing about someone wanting to talk to you. And it's causing them to realize, like, with the Ten of Pentacles here, that, you know, you're their person. Sorry. <laughs> I guess that's a motorcycle um that you are their person here so i had the strength card with leo energy showing up with the star and the devil is now in reverse here so yeah you will get through this just be patient and gentle with yourself at the time capricorns you're kind of like in this crazy period period where things are ending here and it's time to focus on yourself with your dreams need a practical plan to stop this kind of pattern here with this person it's like silent treatment abandonment you guys get back together and then you go and it's like merry go around here so relationships reflect our wounds our self-image here photograph they're looking at you missing at 
looking at your photos here, missing you, nostalgia, making new memories. But I feel like there's a new start, you know, that's coming in where it's like, okay, I'm going to know exactly what I want. So pray, communicate with your angels here. Yeah, watching, looking. This person is literally stalking, like looking at your photos, constantly wondering what you're up to here. They haven't let go at all. Right, the timing is not quite right. Apology, you can expect the apology you want to hear and strictly sexual. The connection is passionate, but not enduring. And don't forget to not dismiss the red flags here, okay? Trust your intuition. Trust your gut here, all right? I'm going to leave it here, Capricorns. Have a wonderful week.